Hey everyone, that concludes challenge three for Secret Valentine on the YouTube New Zealand Facebook group. I hope you guys had heaps of fun like I did. Um, I thoroughly enjoyed my package and I hope um, everyone else who's yet to post their video did as well. I've seen all the nine videos posted so far that people had a good outcome. So just to recap for challenge three, Evie got a package with a whole bunch of things that involved her to roll a dice and wear things on her face. Helena got some items that were of sentimental meaning with a message attached to each one. That was rather romantic. Katia got a package with some punny romantic love poems. Jaren had to cram his face full of lollies that were love hearts and had to play fluffy bunnies but instead this time around secret valentines. Jodie shall be living long and prospering. She got a cool book that was for uh, Star Trek. And Laura's bedroom is probably smelling pretty nice right now with a diffuser. Loopy was challenged to open up her handbag and add a new item to her bag as well and uh, describe to the world the contents of her bag. And Thomas, who loves Minecraft, received a package all the way from Australia and received a pretty sweet pick. And then as many of you may have known, um, I dressed up as a man Rainicorn uh, from someone who really loves Adventure Time, so that was really awesome. But continuing on with the challenges, we have a challenge that happens every fortnight, and this time round we're going to be challenging you to post a video response. Not to any video in particular, just make a video response to a video on YouTube. Um, if you've been on YouTube long enough, you may know that um, video responses were quite popular back in the day, but it's not happening so much now. It's a great way of communicating your ideas and speaking your thoughts and to encourage someone else or to share um, uh, a different point of view to someone else's video. That being said as well, video responses can be used to show your talents um, about something that someone else has produced, on, that, that complements something that someone else has produced online. So there's no prize attached to this one, it's just for you to um, basically try something different if you've never done it before. Otherwise you can use this as a great opportunity to brush up on your own skills of posting video responses on other people's videos. Talking from personal experience, I've been finding video responses to be quite helpful in, uh, in engaging with different audiences. I've engaged with videos that um, have had quite a lot of views and in doing so have brought traffic to my channel and have introduced people to my other content and have um, allowed me to, to make new friends that way because people have been in engaged by what I've had to say in something that they were interested in in a previous video. So take, try your hand in it, I hope you have fun with it and uh, that it takes you somewhere and develops your channel or develops your experience with the different facets of YouTube. I'll see you in the next fortnight for challenge 5 which will commence at the beginning of March when we will have our next collaboration challenge. Have a wonderful fortnight guys, I'll see you later, bye bye.